Good morning, chaps. So, uh, today's video, which would have been filmed yesterday, uh, on reflection, is going to be something a little bit different because I actually spent yesterday at the Rising Sun Beer Festival and I went with a group of chaps. It was a last minute thing. Uh, Dave from our camera group uh, had an operation cancelled. So he was like, do you want to come with me lads? I can't go into hospital. So we all shot over there. I didn't take the cannon with me. I got a few shots on the phone, but it's basically just me on the train going there. And then obviously I just got swept up in conversation and everything else. So I thought I would do something different today on the vlog and show you uh, the beer review that Jay Allington sent in, uh, Rainer, sorry, Rainer Allington, he sent us a version of his Coconut Shy PA called the uh, Solero, which we had on the brew day for the Coconut Shy PA when Tom and Froggy came over. So if you're not that bothered at uh, watching an unedited cut of three blokes standing around a sink drinking a Coconut IPA, then this probably ain't for you. So tune in to tomorrow's vlog. But if you do want to watch it, here's the clip. It was a fantastic beer. Thanks for sending it in. And we'll pick up the vlog tomorrow, aka today, because I'm just about to go into the brewery and we're going to add the dry hops and the coconut to the Shy PA, depending on its gravity. And we're also going to be addressing issues I've had with the ventilation exhaust that we put in the other day. But that's for tomorrow. You can watch that if you don't want to watch this. But here are three blokes having a crack in the shop over a fantastic beer. Ladies and gentlemen, get ready for a treat especial. It is homebrew sent by... Uh, is it Rainer, Jay Rainer? Yeah. Or is he the food critic? Um, no, he's, he's the food critic, isn't he, on Radio 4? Yes. So the kitchen cabinet. So we've got these couple of oh. PAs. Who was it? Tom. Oh. Oh. Um, I did get the message where you were saying, shall I send it to here to do a review? And it wouldn't let me reply to you. Sounds like a total lying. It does. Not it's really, like, he's fibbing. It's like even now I can't get to. Uh, I'm sick to death of these people sending me these coconut shy bloody quotes. I said, ah, from my tippers, Harry. I said, ah, from my tippers. Here we go, that's why. Right. Here we go. Here we go. I'm going to persist with this fibbing team. Right. I'll let the sink rain. Hey, look, rain. Oh, I think I actually got a message off him this morning. Rain. Yeah, and I can now reply. Uh, okay. Yeah, Rainer Allington. Yeah. Hi, mate. Here we are. Hi, mate. Glad the beer's got to you. Okay. I hope you enjoy them and have a good brew day today. Looking forward to seeing the follow up footage. I jump. I jump for Yeah, so I am going to apologise because I got the message from you saying where do you want to send them to and I couldn't get a reply to you because I couldn't work it out and then I forgot about it. Extreme close up. Oh, we're in. Hang on. So what's this? This is Coconut Shy PA, but it's got a different name. It's called... I'm getting good at this, aren't I? Chuck them all up for. Right, I'll open them and then I'll get the piece of paper it's in there. Oh, they fall, they. Oh. Here oh. we are. Here we are, we're in, we're in, we've got it. We've got it. So he's kegged them off, he's bottled them off his keg. And it's called uh, Solero. This is his version of the Shy PA, which is switched up a little bit. I'm making my mouth water this, just smelling it out of the bottle. Solero. Well, I'm going to hold off. No point in doing any other. There is a bell. We've got a wee bit of uh, haze, hazy haze. Could, that could just be chilly, I don't mind about that. Mm -hmm. There's a few particles in mine. 
One on juice. Two on juice. Again, fine for me. He entered it into an Elmbrook competition that one Mile End Brewery was hosting and came third. That was 68. Oh, no. Smells absolutely fucking delightful. It's very nice. It's hard to resist diving straight in in this. Oh, oh, cheers, lads. Cheers, fellas. Yeah, cheers, everyone. Cheers. Cheers. And cheers oh, to oh. you. Cheers, thank you very much. The cop nut. Mm. It's a comma straight through. Oh, man. This is a good comers freak. <laughs> yes. Oh, Jesus, that's uh, some more of that. Mmm. Mmm. Mm -hmm. That's really good. That's that is really good, that. He's nailed it, I think. I think he has. He can nail that. I could have that on the tap all day long. Yeah, I thought you were going to say on toast. On toast. <laughs> oh, that's really nice. Nice body to it. There is a nice body to it. It's a nice cream in there. Yeah. I see where it gets the Solero from. You've yeah. had the ice creams, haven't yeah. you? Yeah. They're thick and juicy. I'm glad I chilled it down as well. It's yeah. nice cold. It's really nice. If you'd have said you've got that from out of oh. mm. Hey, definitely. There's no, there's, there's nothing there that's perfect. There's no, no uh, off flavours or anything. There's no nothing. No mm. grass in this spot at all. Balance. Up. I like it. Well, I think it's safe to say we all like this. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's a bit of filler in it. That's it. Bye. And it come what? Third. Third out of one. Sixty-eight. Yeah, you probably have some twig beer drinkers in the judging yeah. panel. Oh, it's not body turns bitter. I don't like it. That should have come first. No, yeah, that's spot on, that mate. That really is good. Galaxy, Azaka, and Mosaic. Mm. Good I'm combo. I want to know. I want to know why it's London Ale yeast. London Ale three. Where's the other one? No, you don't, don't get all that. I want to know. Well, if it's done with coconut shy, you'd imagine it's followed the recipe just with the alterations. It's slightly different, though, isn't it? Get the coconut, but the coconut's more subtle, isn't it? Yeah, it's not as all the hot bits yeah. in the background, yeah, it's really yeah. showing off. Yeah. Very juicy, mm. very fruity, juicy. Thomas, it's like the Club Tropicana juiciness. Maybe no, that's the wrong it, one. It's, too, it's, it's, it's more one. subdued than that, and I think the creaminess of it is just, yeah. it balances it really, yeah. really well. I was about to say, with all that hop, or different hop characteristics, does it need the coconut? Like I it would stand well without it. Yeah, it would. Mm -hmm. I think I it's adding that premium yeah. to it, and I think that's, that's fucking bang on. Man. That's uh, a nice surprise. Good. Yeah, that's a nice surprise to have. Where would it come on your board? On your board? Yeah. Come on your board? Yeah, yeah. where would it come on your cotton scoreboard? Cotton scoreboard. It would come pretty high. I think it would. I've not had others. But yeah, come on, I think. What you told me behind the scenes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll jump, I'll jump, I'm good at lying, isn't it? <laughs> no, I think it'd score, it'd score high. Uh, the, the problem with that is, is that you, you put it up against a particular beer, so if it doesn't taste like you, it, you're judging it on getting it bang on to taste it exactly like it, so it, yeah. it doesn't necessarily mean it's a terrible beer if it doesn't. It's, that's just the way that it's run. Well, this is different to shine. Definitely, yeah. yeah. So, on that board, pretty high. But it wouldn't top it because it's not Maybe the shine. Top it it's not the shine. Mm. But, my God, man, I would have this. I'd have this as a house beer, isn't Yeah, you? I would have. If someone said you've got to tie a head up, yeah. I'd say, well, look, look at that. that. I'd, tip, I'd tip them more with bitter out. Yeah. Get, get rid of that. Yeah. Mind you, I'm used to tipping beers. Yeah. Oh, we've said no more about yeah. that, shall we? <laughs> I need to know. I'm desperate now to know I'm intrigued. I'm really he wants intrigued. your secrets. Do we will yeah. share. I do. That's really good. That's really, really good. 